In Gresham, a new mayor sworn in the same day the police chief is back on the job, changing her mind about resigning. It's all part of a series of leadership changes at the city amid charges of racism. Our Lisa Balick live in Gresham this afternoon with who will be the new mayor and where the city goes from here. Lisa. Well, we learned today there is a new mayor out here in Gresham. There is also an outside investigation about to get underway into allegations of racism inside City Hall as well as at the police department. Now, this morning, the, one of the city councilors, Carolyn Eccles, was sworn into office as a new mayor. She'll take over until a permanent mayor is elected in November. She's pledged not to run for the office. Eccles takes over for Shane Bemis, who resigned recently after 14 years, saying he needed to focus on his family-owned restaurant struggling during the pandemic. However, he left at the same time as the city manager and the police chief, who announced they were retiring. A time when the deputy city manager, who's black, sent a letter to city leaders accusing them of racism and not implementing police reforms. The new mayor says there's definitely a tough road ahead. Things are unsettled and uncertain and scary, um, but there's also opportunity in that. And so stepping in at this point with this community and the things that we're going through, I, I think that um, we have a strong community. We have people who really believe and put their heart and soul into their community. And as my role uh, as mayor, I, my first priority will be to listen. Now, meanwhile, Police Chief Robin Sells rescinded her letter of resignation and arrived back at work today. She was on the hot seat for criticizing the deputy city manager. We asked to speak with her, but was told she would not comment today. But the city attorney says an investigation into accusations of the city as, quote, a hostile work environment is about to get underway. Now, the city council last week had approved raising a Black Lives Matter flag out front of City Hall. We checked, and it's not there. We'll explain why coming up tonight at 5. Live in Gresham, Lisa Balick, Coin 6 News. All right.